Hello everybody. Uh, how are things going with everyone else out there? Uh, with me, I'm trying to hang on. I'm still, still down. I'm trying to get on with life. You know, I've noticed how much people have been heartless to me and even put me down calling me an alcoholic or a drug user when I'm, and I'm neither one of those you know uh, things went wrong with jobs and everything and I end up being like this you know it hurts how people can judge and think I'm like scum you know I'm tired of being treated like dirt you know I, this is one thing that is really hard on me that has happened to me in my life That's right. I was on life support from a back surgery with my spine, lower spine because I messed it up while working and things aren't wrong through the surgery. So, and, uh, and this is This is part of what I'm going to show, you know, it's pretty much about the way I am. This, this is about, pretty much about me right here. You know, that's, that's what I think about me. You know, I, I have a heart, I go out of my way for people, if I ever, every time if I ever seen someone that was in need of help, you know, even if their, like, their cars broke down, I would stop to help them. I even, when I had a home myself and I seen homeless, I would find out about them. And if they was the good kind of people, I would help them. Because, you know, I don't support alcoholics or drug users. I, I, I won't help those kind of people because that, that's, that's all they care about life and it's not right. You know, there's a lot more important in life than doing those things. I've been seeing too many people dying over that. I've known some people that have died for being alcoholic or using drugs you know it and it, it is so sad that this happens uh, I don't know why people want to go doing that it, you know taking that route you would think they they would want to live and everything and, and care about their life. You know, life is too short. It's 
how how can people just take advantage of life? We all got, we all got to think, you know. What? Why do? You, no, we got to be there for our kids. You know, our other relatives, good friends that we have. It came down to dying and then and family and friends finds out that it was like from being alcoholism or drug using. No, it does hurt them too. Because you have those two kind of people in your life that cares you know they be there for you and they wouldn't want that to happen to you and a lot of these people also go to jail for for uh, being drug users and that Alcoholics because the alcoholics, you know, they get so drunk and they want to fight. You know. Well, I'm still hoping that, that people out there can understand where I'm coming from and think about you know what I'm what I say you know, you know I lost my home from losing my job you know, I lost my daughter all because of being homeless I'm st st still in I've been trying to find, find her and hoping to re, reunite with her, and it hurts. I think about her every day, ho hoping that she still knows me and her mom. We want it. We want her back in our life, and we're trying so hard. We're we're really struggling. Uh, I'm and with me being disabled, I'm fighting for Social Security. Um, she's trying to get get another job again and this is just very hard and heartbreaking on us no if, if we could just had to have the help so you know put us up in a home or something it was like that and, Help us get back on our feet, cause that's what we want. We don't, we don't want to be like this. Yeah. We want to have our love back again, cause uh, the love has been fading, cause of all of this. Yeah. We we heard it every day. E emotionally, and with me, I'm emotionally and physically hurting every day.
There's, I'm doing things that I shouldn't be doing. I could end up being paralyzed. Just to keep things going and try to get out of this situation. Oh. Everyone, have a blessed day. Hopefully, we will be getting blessed soon. God bless everyone. Bye.